Welcome to my channel. I'm Katya. It's great to have you with me. Thank you so much for joining me. Today I have a 15 minutes routine with focus on back strength. I've picked my favorite strengthening back exercises and put them together into a short little sequence so that you can fit it into your busy day. This class is part of my Happy Back Hair program released on my platform. And if you'd like to find out more, click on the link above here or in the link in the description below. I have a cushion. Go and grab yourself one, roll out your mat and let's begin. Let's start in a child's pose. You can have your knees close together or your knees slightly apart. Sit back to your heels and for a moment allow yourself to release forwards. Choose any arm position that feels good for you. Invite a deep breath in here. And exhale. One more inhaling. Exhale. So even so it's a very short practice today. We're going to still focus and concentrate 100%. Rock yourself forwards onto your hands and knees. Our first exercise is our Superman Superwoman with a variation, which is a brilliant exercise to strengthen our back. Inhale. Exhale. Take the right leg back together with your left arm reaching forwards. Hold it here, inhale, keep the leg lifted, exhale as if you're doing a lat pull, pull the left elbow out to the side and down. Inhale, reach the arm out forward, exhale, lower hand and knee down. So I'm going to change the breathing just a little bit. Inhale, reach out, other arm and leg. Exhale, pull the elbow back. Inhale, reach your arm forward. Exhale, lower down, stabilizing your trunk, your pelvis. Inhale, other side. Exhale, pull the elbow back. Inhale, reach. Exhale, lower. Inhale, other side. Stabilize. Exhale, the arm pulls. Imagine you're pulling on a band or heavy weight. Inhale, reach. Exhale, lower. Inhale, lengthen. Exhale, pull the elbow, inhale, reach out, and lower down. One more on the other side, inhale, reach, exhale, elbow, inhale, lengthen, exhale, lower down. Good. Next exercise, we're going to do forearm plank alternating with swings. Come down onto your elbows. Push the floor away, feel a widening across the shoulder blades. Step your feet back and finding your beautiful long line through your plank. Inhale here. Exhale, push the floor away. Inhale, lower the knees down. Exhale, uncurl the toes. Roll yourself forwards, draw the chest and heart forwards into your sphinx. So a little bit of extension now. Inhale here. Exhale, look down to your hands, peel yourself away from the floor, tuck the toes under, engaging the muscles at the front of the body. So this is super important to also help get the back of the muscles stronger. Inhale, exhale, hold. Inhale, knees down, relax the toes, peel yourself forwards, draw the chest, the heart forwards. Inhale. Exhale, one more time, into your forearm plank. Tuck the toes under and lift. Hold it, inhale. Exhale, hold. Inhale, lower the knees. Exhale, draw the chest forwards. Lift yourself up here. Breathe in and breathe out. Good. Feel free to tuck your cushion underneath your tummy for this next exercise. Lie yourself down, slide your arms out to the side for your cobra. From here, reaching the tailbone towards your heels. Inhale. Exhale, lengthen the crown of the head forwards. Shoulder blades sliding to your hips. Lift yourself up. Right now you've got your arms down. You can feel a little bit the arms pulling back on the 
floor on the mat, the chest reaching forwards, and then lower back down. Inhale. Exhale, pubic bone heavy. Reach the crown of the head forward. Shoulder blades drawing towards your hips. Hold it here, inhale. Exhale, lower back down. Breathing in. Breathe out. Elongate length and lifting up. Hold. And lower down. One more. Inhale. Exhale. Reaching forwards. Visualize a long, 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 long spine. And lower yourself back down. Now take your arms next to your body, palms facing down. Inhale. Exhale. Lift the arms and then squeeze your shoulder blades towards each other. And then lower your arms, relax your shoulders. Again, lift the arms up. See if you can squeeze the shoulder blades towards each other, but so also feel the shoulders sliding down. And then release it down. Do that again. Arms up, shoulders drawing down, and a little bit towards each other. Just a little bit. And release. Two more. Arms up. A little bit the shoulder blades towards each other, and then slide them down the ribcage. And release. One more here. Arms up, shoulder blades towards each other, and down, down, down towards your hips. And release. Good. Here's a little extra. Lift the arms, shoulders down, float up the chest and the head. Hold it, circle the arms out to the side, stop here, or even reach your arms forwards. Circle the arms all the way back next to your body and lower everything down. Inhale, exhale, arms, shoulders, chest, head. You're not coming up high, you're very long. You inhale, open the arms to the side. You can stop here if that feels enough, or you can reach your arms further forwards. Open the arms out to the side, reach them all the way back. You should feel those back muscles working, and lower yourself down. Inhale, lengthen the tailbone to the heels. You can draw your tummy in. Arms, shoulders, chest, head. Arms opening, pause, or continue with the arms. The more the arms go forward, the more the back muscles are loaded. Open the arms out to the side and reach them back, 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 back. And lower back down. Good. Two more. Inhale. Exhale. So don't be afraid to use your back muscles. They are going to work. Arms out to the side. Stop here. Or reach the arms forwards. Keep looking down so the back of the neck stays long. Reach your arms all the way back. And lower down. Well done. Last time. Inhale. Exhale. Arms. Shoulder blades. Chest, head. Good. Abdominals drawing up for support. Arms opening. Maybe circling further forward. Arms circling all the way back. Long, 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 long. And release it down. Well done. Rock your hips a little bit side to side. Push yourself up onto your hands and knees. And give yourself a stretch. Gently sit back to your heels. Inhale. And exhale here. Good. Come and turn onto your back. Lie down onto your side. And then roll yourself onto your back. Good. You can put your cushion under your head if you like. That feels good. Feet hip distance apart. Arms next to your body. Good. We're going to do five bridges and then five with articulation going up and down. Inhale. Exhale. Press down into the floor. Lift your hips up. Fire up your glutes. Abdominals engaged. Inhale. Exhale. On the way down, try and gently roll down to get just a little bit more release through the spine. Inhale. Exhale. Push down. Bridge yourself up. So you're just lifting straight up using those glutes and legs. Inhaling here. Exhaling. Melt the spine slowly down. Breathing in. Breathe up. Press down. Lift up. Hold. And slowly come down. Hopefully that feels really nice on your back now. Inhale. Exhale, ground into the feet, 
squeeze up, inhale, hold, exhale, melting the spine down. Good. I think we've done five. Forgive me if it's one less. Now let's roll up if you can. Rolling yourself up. Good. Length through the lower back. Remember, you're thinking of your pubic bone towards your ribs. So you're really scooping the, the hips under. Inhale. Exhale. Roll slowly down. Inhale. Exhale. Rolling yourself slowly up. Reaching the knees forwards in line with your toes. Inhale. Exhale. Peel the spine slowly down. Vertebrae by vertebrae, as much as it's possible. Inhale, exhale, rolling up. Breathe in. And breathe out, roll yourself slowly down. Good, last two. Inhale, exhale, rolling up again. Breathe in. Breathe out, roll slowly down. Inhale, final one, rolling up. You should feel those hamstrings. Inhale, exhale, slowly come down. Well done. Draw one knee into the chest, draw the other knee into the chest and give yourself a little rock side to side. Well done, good. Then bringing your feet down, hands behind the head, squeeze your legs together. Inhale. Exhale, take the knees to the side. If you have osteoporosis, you don't want to go so far. Just keep it gentle with your twist. If all is good, otherwise you can reach your knees across. So go as far as it feels good for you. Inhale, exhale, draw the tummy in, come back. Reach your knees to the other side. So maybe just a small movement or you can go further. Inhale, exhale, come back. Try and keep the elbows wide and your shoulder blades Pretty much grounded, yes. And working from the center. Reach the knees over. And come back. Last two going over. And center. And over. And center. Good. Then roll yourself to the side. Push yourself all the way up to sitting. Our final exercise, you can sit in any position or you can even come up to standing as long as you can have good posture. So sitting, it's important. You're really nice and tall. Reach your arms up in here. Make fists and now for strengthening the upper back, pull the elbows down as if you're pulling a heavy weight down. Inhale, reach your arms up. So pretend You've got that heavy weight. Elbows slowly down. Strong, 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 strong. Lifting up tall. Inhale, reach. Yes, good. Just a couple more. And pull down. Sitting up taller, 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 taller. Yes, good. So the muscles that are lying on either side of your spine, like big ropes, they're also working. Pull down. Reach the arms up. And then circle the arms all the way down and relax brilliant so this these were seven exercises really nice short little sequence if you're short on time but you still want to do something good for your back highly recommend you can do that as often as you like and then if you can combine it with the stretches as well perfect uh, i think your back will be very happy you can keep your back happy of course, always listen to your body and adapt as needed. Thank you for joining me today and I see you for the next class. Have a great day. If you enjoyed this routine, please share this video and subscribe to my channel. And if you'd like more Pilates and yoga content, check out my online video membership.